Hello, YouTube. I'm Dr. Fox. Today, let's think about this question. Is it safe to use a sauna, jacuzzi, hot tub, or steam room if you are pregnant? Before we answer this, we should discuss why it's important to regulate your body temperature and how you can do that. Your body will heat up or cool down depending on how hot or cool the environment around you is and how much water you have drunk. You may feel warmer than usual during your pregnancy, which is completely normal as it's caused by hormonal changes in your body. It's a normal environment and if you've had enough to drink, your body has ways to cool itself down naturally it sends more blood to your skin and you start sweat. But if you are in a steam room or a hot tub, you cannot sweat so your core body temperature can rise significantly and that can be dangerous. Even if you are only there briefly, when you get out, you will start sweating a lot. That means that as your body is sending more blood to the skin, there is less blood going to other parts of your body, including your brain, which can make you feel dizzy. Pregnant women can be prone to fainting anyway due to the hormonal changes in the body and putting yourself in this stressful environment can increase the risk. Some research has suggested that if you stay in a hot tub for more than 10 minutes, your body temperature can reach over 38 degrees Celsius, which would be classified as a fever in other circumstances. The danger here is that the babies in the womb of women who have very high body temperatures during their first trimester may have neural tube defects. This means that they are born with serious damage to the brain or spinal cord. It's true that not much research has been carried out, but what there is also suggests that if you have a high temperature while you're pregnant, you also run a higher risk of having a miscarriage. Although, we don't yet know whether the high temperature you have due to a natural fever has the same effect as the high temperature you get by being in a hot tub, we recommend you don't use one just in case. So, when you are pregnant, you should drink a lot of water, don't wear tight clothes to exercise, and avoid saunas, jacuzzis, hot tubs, and the like, particularly during the first trimester. If you use a pool, check the temperature of the water. In exercise pools, which some continental classes use, it should be no higher than 32 degrees Celsius, and in hydrotherapy pools, the maximum is 35 degrees Celsius. Remember that the water in hot tubs can get as hot as 40 degrees Celsius. If you really want to use a hot tub, the golden rules to follow are First, don't spend more than 10 minutes in the hot tub. Second, stay as far away from the inlet where newly heated water comes in as you can. Third, don't put your head, arms, shoulders or upper chest under water. Fourth, if you feel uncomfortable, immediately get out. Lastly, if you already feel ill or you are hot because you have been exercising or for any other reason, don't get straight in the hot tub. If you have already used a hot tub and are worried, you can ask your doctor about ways to find out whether there has been neural tube damage to your baby. Okay, another question is, what about other super treatment? It depends on the treatment. Some are safe and some are not. And you may find some beauty treatments are more painful than normal. If a treatment raises your core body temperature, such as smart baths, CU wraps, hot wax, or etc., avoid it while you are pregnant because it will have the same effect as a steam room and you will risk overheating. Although beauty treatments like facial and scrubs may not be dangerous in themselves, your skin is probably a lot more sensitive now you are pregnant. You should always do a patch test, even with a product you have used before, to make sure you are not going to have a bad reaction. It's a similar picture with boxing. Having your eyebrows 
legs or bikini line down may not be dangerous, but equally it may be far more painful than it's ever been before. Thank you for watching. See you soon.